I'm doing doing pretty good, thank you. Especially now since it has stopped raining, so I will not get wet driving my bike home. Okay, so in this video clip we're going to talk about comparing numbers. Okay, and if you look here on my right, we have two people. We have Tom, and he has one, two, three, four, five red flowers. Okay, and then we have Danny, and she has one, two, three, four, five blue flowers. So they both have five flowers. Tom has five flowers. Danny has five flowers. So they have equal numbers of flowers. So when we are talking about the same number, they have the same number of things, items, whatever, in this case flowers, then we write it as six equals six. They have the same number, equal number. Okay? Good. Then in this here scenario we have Danny, same as Danny over there, and she has one, two, three, four, five, same, five blue flowers. But then we have Paul, and he has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight red flowers. Eight red flowers. So Paul has more flowers than Danny. Eight is greater than five, and greater than that we write as this. Eight and then crocodile mouth is and then five. And the crocodile mouth, the mouth, the opening should point to the bigger number. Because the crocodile he wants to eat the bigger number. Okay? So this is how we write greater than. Eight is greater than five. Okay? And then we have some more. So, uh, so this one first. Five is smaller than eight. Smaller than. Smaller than eight. So that we write as five and then the crocodile cow and then eight. So we write it just like that but opposite sides. Because now we have smaller, before we had greater. So smaller than the crocodile mouth should not face the smaller number. It should face the bigger number. But you start to write the smaller number first. And then you do the crocodile mouth in the opposite direction. It should not be on this way to be like this away okay do you understand so you have to pay attention to if it's greater or smaller so greater you start with the bigger number first and then the crocodile mouth eats the bigger number but if it's smaller than then you write the smaller number first and then the bigger number and the crocodile mouth in that direction towards the bigger number okay i hope you understand and then lastly now danny's and paul's number of flowers is not equal not equal remember when it's equal you write equal Tauga. six equals six but now not equal, not the same. Then you write five equal and then you cross out the equal eight. So you cross out equal and then cross out. Because they are not the same, not equal. Okay? Good. I hope you understand this. So we have one, two, three, four. I hope you understand.
understand this form. Okay? I'm going to tell you about one more thing. Uh, so, let's, let's take this off. Okay, so now Tom has four flowers, then he has five flowers. So, this is four flowers, this is five flowers. So, five is greater, is greater than four. So, five is greater or bigger than four. Okay? And then four is smaller than five. Four is smaller than five. Okay? Because four is smaller than number five. Five is bigger than number four. But they use math mathematical terms greater, smaller. That is, those are the correct mathematical terms, words to use. But you can say four is less than five. No igual, less. Or five is bigger than four. Bigger, ya igual. Okay? But these two terms are the grammatically correct mathematical terms. Okay? Alright. Good. Do you understand? I hope you do. So now I want you to do pages 161 and 162 and 163 okay three pages okay uh, do I need to go through uh, okay I will go through a little bit briefly okay so take out your books and then I will briefly explain the exercises but they are fairly easy to understand anyway but just briefly. Okay? So take out your books and I will change my camera angle and I will see you on page 161. Okay? Alright, see you in a little bit. Okay. So here we are on page 161. So, first of um, this exercise is a bit difficult to do when you're not at school. Use blocks to show and compare these numbers. Which number is the smallest or greatest? But because you don't have any blocks, let me show you. They want you, the book wants you to show the teacher like this. 11, 12 blocks. So, smallest greatest okay but since we don't you don't have any blocks or at least you can show me so then we just jump down to exercise number one do and learn circle the greater number and then cross out the smaller number so you need to do two things you need to first circle the number that is bigger the greater number and then you need to cross out the number that is the smaller number Okay, so I will help you with A. So circle the greater number. So 13 is greater than 11. And then cross out the smaller number. So I will cross out 11 because 11 is smaller than 13. Okay, so please do B, C and D. And then we go to number 2. Here you write equals or not equals in each box. I will do I will help you with the first one. A, 10, mm -hmm, 14. Is that equal 
Is that the same number? No. So it is not the same number, not equal. Okay? Please do B, C and D. Alright. And then we go to the next page. 162. So exercise number one. Mark or check the set with the greater number of objects. So you have set A and set B. So you will tick or check or mark the set that has bigger, more, a num uh, which, uh, which has the bigger number, greater number, more items. Okay, so you count how many birds and then you tick the box that has the greater number of objects. Okay, number two, compare the number of objects, same as in number one, write greater than or smaller than. So here you actually need to write, not just check. You count how many paper clips and then you answer set A is mm -hmm, set B. So then you will use either greater than or smaller than. So set A is greater than set B or set A is smaller than set B. Okay? And number three, you write bigger than or smaller than. Right? So you will know this because as I taught you in the video, they will always point left to the either to the bigger or to the smaller number. The bigger or smaller number will always come first. So this will always be the bigger or smaller number depending on what they're asking for. Okay? So here they're asking for a smaller number. So 15 is smaller than 17. Okay, and then um, B, 18 is bigger than 13. And as I will explain that one more time, I know that they're asking for smaller here and bigger here, because you always look at the first number. So that's why I, I know that in A they're asking for, for smaller number, because that is first. So you cannot say 17 is bigger than 15. You can say it, but it's more correct to do it, to say 15 is smaller than 17. Okay? So here you need to say 18 is bigger than 13. It is incorrect if you say 13 is smaller than 18. Because you always talk about the first number first. Okay? So please do C, D, E, F, G, and H. And the last page, 163. So here, number four, compare the number of toy balls that each student has. So Ravi, he has volleyballs. Janice, she has basketballs. And Peter, he has footballs. So you will write how many of each balls they have, and then D. Ravi has more balls than who? Magua Kai. And Ravi has fewer balls than, so more balls, Magua. Fewer, Noigua. Okay? And then F. Mm -hmm. A person, Peter, Janice, Ravi, has the greatest number of balls. Greatest. You remember what greatest means? The most has the most balls of all of these people. And then G mm -hmm, has the smallest number of balls. The least. Notice it. Okay? Good. So please finish these exercises and then give your phone to your parents because I will give them the correct answers. Alright? Good. So, take care and I will see you in the next clip. Now, stop the video and go give, your, give the phone to your parents and the book. Okay? Alright, take care and bye-bye.
Okay, so now this part is for you, mothers and fathers. Okay, so I have now given you the correct answers. So 1a, 13 is the greater number, 11 is the smaller number. And then b, 14 smaller, 16 greater, c, 14 greater, 13 smaller, and d, 18 smaller and 19 greater. And then number 2, number uh, a is not equal to, b is equal, c is equal, d is not equal to. Alright, and next page here, set a is greater than set b. So tick, check uh, set a. And then 2, set a is greater than set b. It has more paper clips. And then number 3, so 15 is less or smaller than 17. 18 is greater than 13, and so on and so on. And then the last page, 163. So, Ravi, Janice and Peter. Ravi has 14 volleyballs, Janice has 15 basketballs, and Peter has 12 footballs. So D, Ravi has more balls than Peter. Ravi has fewer, less balls than Janice. And then F. Janice has the greatest number of balls. She has the most balls. And then Peter has the smallest number of balls. So he has the least uh, number of balls. Okay? So these are the correct answers. Please check your child's or children's uh, homework, well, ex exercises. Okay? And take care. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.